side over the medical district 513 on your Thursday on a morning that does not feel really bad at all feels pretty good right now Tim starting to feel a little more summer like because humidity has gone up a little bit more temperatures are sitting around the 70s most of the night if you have dropped into the middle 60s mid 60s and low 70s camera view is just about perfect everywhere from downtown outside of uh, SRP Park over the dam and at Beach Island cam wide perspective of downtown Augusta Currents right now have dropped into the middle 60s. We were about 70 to 72 for the last three hours, so 66. That's the official temperature at the airport. Heading into the rest of the morning, we'll bounce around with 60s and 70s. How about the afternoon? Heating up. It is going to get hot and definitely feel more summer-like with that combination of heat and humidity. Highs in the 90s later on today. Still a pretty decent evening, though. Thirsty Thursday out at SRP Park. Old popular one out there. 7 o'clock temperatures in the mid 80s. That's really been the range all week here for temperatures right around 7, 8 o'clock. Still in the middle 80s. But upper 60s. Barnwell, 68 to 70, 72 here. Back and forth, we've seen temperatures go anywhere between 68 to 72 also for the last several hours. Pretty nice uh, outlook for the next couple of days. Other than maybe a general pop-up shower or thunderstorm, it could be popping up during the heating of the afternoon over the next couple of days. Upper 80s out there at the late forecast. But hot highs, it's all about a trend of 90-degree weather. Really starting today all the way through the start of next week. 88's normal, so really we're not that far away from the average. 88 topping out that uh, average. We're going to see possibly a little bit of a cool down. We may back it off a little bit more from, say, Chicago to D.C., down towards our area, northern Georgia. But keep in mind, if we get cooler than 88, still the range is about 85 to 86 degrees, even in some of next week after we have the trend of 90 start working out of the picture. So rain chances, they'll come and go as well pop up showers or a thunderstorm over the next couple of days not a washout by any means but just because we're getting so hot and there's humidity the winds are steering a little bit more to the south kind of giving us a little bit better chance for an isolated storm there's been storms out across parts of mississippi from overnight creating a severe thunderstorm out there in jackson about an hour ago well high pressure has been the dominant feature here starting to relax that a little bit more turning our winds more to the south heat and humidity building through the afternoon starting off with 60s and 70s Lunchtime temperatures moving their way through the middle 80s and we'll see a mix of clouds and sun as we start getting a little bit hotter. But throughout this evening seems to be the magic time about 9 10 o'clock over the next couple of days. Here's 10 p.m. So we may just have some of our northern counties along and north of I-20 seeing a thunderstorm passing by just before midnight. A quiet Friday morning start mid 60s and low 70s. We'll move our way into Friday afternoon. Here's temperatures again heating up in the upper 80s at midday and back into the afternoon highs there with upper 80s and low 90s. So 9 o'clock tomorrow night. 10 o'clock in the evening, 9 to 10, we could have another passing shower storm all the way into our next couple of evenings. So just keep in mind here, rumble of thunder, a quick little shower storm. That's going to be the possibility as we get in the 90s and stay there through Memorial Day, 91 to 93 degrees. And then there's that little bit of a drop into the upper 80s heading into Tuesday and Wednesday.